Hi, I'm Kate and I'm here with news about our upcoming release, version 4.18. I'll go over everything in detail, but here's a few highlights to get you started. Our next upgrade will include an option for organisations to control how long before administrators get logged out of the software, the ability to remove optional fields from the contact page in the application form, volunteer application forms that can be filled out on mobile phones, a layout change to give you more room on your volunteer homepage to share your stories, a customizable help link that you can use to direct your volunteers to your own help pages or volunteer manual. And for those of you with enterprise accounts, you can create shift templates at the enterprise level that can be shared with all of your accounts. Okay, let's look at all of this and more in greater detail. In our last release, we added a security feature which automatically logs administrators out after 30 minutes of inactivity. A number of our clients let us know that this timing was too short, so we decided to make this a configurable option. Just go to Configuration, Organization Settings, Security Settings. Select the option to override the default setting and enter the timing you'd like to use. You can also configure whether or not you'd like the title bar to flash, giving you a two minute warning before logging you out. In addition to the help files that we have created, you can add a link here to anything that you create elsewhere as an online volunteer manual. We've noticed clients using the news section as a revolving newsletter, so we've added the option of adding a scroll bar here. Now you have choice over how long a section will look. In the past, your only option was for it to scroll with the page like this. Now you can have it scroll independently, so that the page doesn't become too long. We've also added a new layer of security. If the capture system thinks this might be some sort of automated code trying to create a profile, it will present them with a series of pictures that humans can easily identify, but automated code cannot. In most cases, your applicants will not see this. We have also made it possible for volunteers to apply from their mobile phones. While we were at it, we added general interests, general availability and access to inactive activities for logging hours to the mobile interface. Those new features and mobile performance tweaks are all part of our ongoing commitment to add more mobile functionality to the system. Lastly, for volunteer impact enterprise installations, shift templates created at the enterprise will be available to accounts under the enterprise. That's it for version 4.18. Thank you for all of those of you who contributed to suggestions. Please keep them coming in. We certainly can't do everything, but we love to do what we can.